From the outside, the quest of the inventor may seem to be one of solitude, a lone explorer seeking insight from within. But for Rebecca Richards Cordham, it's her connection with others that allows her to thrive. When you run, you have to make a commitment to yourself that you're gonna do it. You have to honor that commitment to get to the finish line. I was very fortunate to be in a program at MIT that was joint with Harvard. And I just discovered when I got into that clinical environment that I was really interested in the technology that was there. I found that to be so inspiring to be part of that team that is thinking about how can we make care better. When I moved to Rice, I was invited to come to Malawi. I had never experienced what it was like to be in one of those clinics and talk the struggles that they experienced. Half of these babies who are born prematurely struggle to breathe because their lungs are premature. Every hospital in Africa has a room that we call the equipment graveyard. If any one piece of that equipment was functional, it could be saving lives. It made me come back with a commitment to thinking about what role could technology play in a setting where it was currently so limited. The bubble CPAP system that we've developed, that device has been sold in 34 different countries. It's now in every single government hospital in Malawi, and it's saving newborn lives in over 30 countries around the world. When I look at the technologies that our team has developed together, I think this team perspective is so essential. Being at a university and being an educator helps make you feel like it's possible to bring students together who share that commitment to take on those big problems. For Richards Cordham, the joy of innovation comes not just from the innovation itself, but how that innovation makes the world better for others. Whether it's improving the lives of those in need or being a mentor to students, the deepest value she finds in her pursuit of science is sharing that pursuit with others. One of the things that inspired me about running is the power of your support team to motivate you when you just don't think you can take another step.